Now, be alert, be aware. That warning for students tonight from the Memphis Shelby County School District. Memphis police have teamed up with the FBI to find the man responsible for abducting and sexually assaulting young girls in South Memphis. Action News 5's Joyce Peterson live now in studio with important information, Joyce, for parents and children. Yeah, Joy and Joe, Memphis police say the attacks happened while the victims were walking to school early in the morning near Hamilton K-8 through and Hamilton High. MPD won't say exactly how many abductions there have been, only that several investigations are underway right now. Tonight, cops and educators are warning parents, protect your daughters until this guy is caught. In the heart of South Memphis, fear fills the heart of mothers like Sierra Dowdy. I, I, I was molested, so this, you know, one thing I fear the most for, you know, young girls, especially like me having two daughters, don't nothing bother me more than it. Memphis police believe the same suspect abducted and sexually assaulted several young girls over the last few weeks as they walked to Hamilton K-8 through and Hamilton High in the following neighborhoods, Gaslight, Bunker Hill, and Cane Creek. MPD confirms one attack happened April 13th at the corner of Silver Street and Ethlin Avenue. Investigators say the suspect is a black man in his early 20s driving a dark-colored SUV. Memphis Shelby County Schools issued a safety alert Wednesday, telling parents and students to be alert and be aware. MSCS Interim Superintendent Tony Williams said we are asking our families and community to assist us by being extra sets of eyes and ears. In this moment, she said, we must unite and work together to keep our children safe. MSCS Commissioner Frank Johnson represents the Hamilton District. It is all hands on deck, he says. Uh, talk to your children about what's happening. Let them know. Uh, if you can, you know, tell your children to walk in groups. If you can walk to school with them, you know, let's try to walk to school with them. The FBI and Shelby County Sheriff's Office now working with MPD to crack this case. There will be additional patrols in the area and more MSCS security guards at the schools. And eagle-eyed neighbors like Annetta Berry are ready to get this dangerous creep off the street. Uh, when we sit outside, myself and my neighbors, a couple of my neighbors and her, we'll sit outside and watch these babies. And we're going to have to be more vigilant as far as our babies and grandbabies and other children are uh, out here playing because it takes a village. Yes, it does. So listen up. Commissioner Johnson told me he's getting volunteers together to patrol while the kids walk to school tomorrow. So the meetup is at Hamilton High tomorrow morning, 7 a.m. And if you or your children see anything or know anything, even if you don't think it's significant, report it to the police to help them catch this guy. And you can call Crime Stoppers anonymously at 901-528-CASH. Live in studio tonight, I'm Joyce Peterson. Joe, back to you.